is Bee Swarm Simulator, and today we'll be fighting the Stump Snail. Yeah, that's right. We're going to be destroying him. And also there, the Coconut Crab. Yeah, he's going down as well. Who else will be destroying this episode? Well, you don't know until you watch. So hey, let's do this now. Let's go jump down there and get right into the battle. Yeah, I was on top of a Lion Bee. I was getting the Lion's Heart. So I'm ready for this battle. So I'm going to destroy him as quick as I can. So as you see, we're in the battle right now with no boost going. He's taking some damage. Yes, he is. But if we equipped some tropical drinks and oil, these two in particular, we gain some more amazing powers. And also, some fire goodness is also great, too. Now, we're going to use a stainer to give a little bit more damage to the fight. As you see, it's doing some glorious things. We walked into him to get that coconut, coconut boost. Now, we're doing even more damage. By the way, it's 300 for those that don't know. Man, we're annihilating him way faster than I expected. Look at this. Look at him go. Wait, why did my mouse not do it? I tried to zoom in, then zoom out, zoom in, and it didn't work. It didn't want to do its thing. So, for those that don't know, you can build, like, grind as you're doing this. Some people just literally sit there and just do nothing. Just look at the stump snail the whole time. Like, I do that some of the time. But right now, I'm not doing that. So now we're doing even more damage. We got some stainers because of this amazing star. Hit the stainer token. We got the boost. We got the stainers. We got it all. And yes, we do have the stainer boost. Ow! I do not have another emergency coconut, though. That would have been very, 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 very beneficial. Now we're going to continue fighting. Now we're going to continue moving. Oh my gosh. Look at it go. We're slowly bringing them down, as you can see. Yo! Oh my gosh, this is... Actually, I'm going to be surprised with you guys. I'm going to be honest and surprised at the same exact time. That's why I said it like that. Is I didn't actually think I was going to destroy him in like two more minutes. I thought I was going to have like a five minute more time limit on this or something. But there we go. He's going to be annihilated. He's going down. He's going down real fast, actually. Oh my gosh. Um, Stump Snail, I honestly thought more of a larger fight out of you, man. I honestly want to one-shot you one day, but I don't think that's going to happen. That would be pretty cool. And bam, we got a diamond. Come on. Come on. I have an emerald. Why would I want to switch off for a diamond? The boosts are lower on that one as well. So I'm going to keep the old, not the new. And I hope I didn't mess up like that because that would have been terrible. Oh, my gosh. So bad. So let's go and get rid of some of this honey and continue on on our fight. You know, honestly, I didn't have to cut there at all. I could have kept going. But to be honest, I wanted to drink and I didn't want to do it in the video. So that's where the cut was going. Now my, my throat is getting dry and that happened. So what we're going to do for this one, we're just going to change things up a little tiny bit. Yes, we have our demon mask. Yes, we have our spicy demon bee, lion bee, uh, music bee, who gives that nice little critical bonus. Our looker bee, who gives a nice bonus as well. Yes, we have all those. And we have the bonuses from all our items, including all my amulets. Yes, every single one of them have some form of damage on them. Yeah, that's right. I have that all. And our level does come into factor. But when you have falling coconuts, it makes everything better. Because there's a chance you're going to actually do a lot of damage to them. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. That's right. That is right. For the lower tier players that are wondering and curious, yes, you too can defeat them. You just need, obviously, the silly, easy stuff. Like, for example, oil and tropical drinks are the two main things that give you the extra damage. Also, having the bees that give damage or do damage are awesome. Like, for example, Lion B. That one is extremely good because it also gives one color's bee attack to all your bees. Spicy B. Uh, I think Demon B gives it. Hold up, hold up. I can never remember. We know Brave gives four plus attack. So, Brave B is honestly one you should have on your team. Along with uh, plus is one B attack high bonus. That is honestly amazing. But uh, uh, the Haste and Looker B gives uh, critical focus. Which is amazing. You get 10 of those. For them there. We have the fire power. Yes, plus three. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Rage B also gives some B attack as well. Just going to tell you that for the gifted variety. of Four for Riley. And then obviously we have the demon. Who gets five. And then I don't know if this multiplies the more you have of said. I, I can test that. Lion gives stuff. You get what I'm saying. You get a lot of damage, and also the spicy. You know spicy gives it. 
spicy 100% gives in. It gives a rage, grants you bees one plus attack for 45 seconds. That rage token is amazing. You only have three of those, but you can keep on going. This kind of turned into a how-to without even meaning to sh show you guys what to do. It was supposed to be just me destroying things, but I guess I'm showing you guys the methods of the destroying stuff now. 13 minutes for that one. Okay. Okay. Team Beetle, pretty simple, pretty easy. You can just try them, no problem. Early game, zero issue. And plus, if you're in Coconut um, area, I'm assuming you are strong enough to fight that guy, by the way, because you need a lot of bees. So we got all this. As you see, I didn't even have to do much. By the way, this right here from the Spicy Bee is amazing. It literally drops multiple bees that are fire-related out. Yes, I think the Demon Bee does it too. I'm not sure. Hey, what's up, guys? Let's go. Yes, destroy you all as I walk around. Yes. You know, I really wish an aphidor or aphid would pop up in this episode because that would be nice, but turning that back off because we don't need it on right now. You know, it'd be really funny if I ran into a spy uh a vicious bee. No, I'm not that's what I'm actually looking for right now. I'm looking for a vicious bee. Okay, we know one wasn't over there. That is pretty, pretty obvious. But you know what? There's a werewolf out there up there for us. Yeah, that is 100% true. A werewolf for me, for you, for all of us, as you can see, too. And no stainer yet again. Sad day. I know, I know. You guys want to see me fight a, a vicious bee in a matter of seconds. And I can't make it nighttime to daytime. Hello, scorpions. Welcome, welcome, welcome. You know what? Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to use a night bell to make it nighttime again when it turns daytime. That sounds great. I'm not getting a drink this time. I'm not going to have anything to drink. I promise. I'm lying to you. That's going to happen. It's going to happen. So I made a major revelation while I was buying my, you know, amazing and beautiful bell. I, I didn't forget the name. No, not at all. I just can still buy another mythic egg. I think I bought two of them already. And I can buy a ton of these diamond eggs just because I can. But will I do it? Probably in the future. Who knows what I might do? I, I honestly don't know. But let's do this now. Let's go and fight ourselves a vicious bee. Hopefully it pops up right here so I don't have to go anywhere. That will be a beautiful, amazing thing to happen right now. Come on, Stainer. Just pop up. Pop up for me. Come on. Come on. Just do me that favor. Do me that one little favor. No. No. Okay, I'll walk up here. Maybe I'll get lucky and this it's on the cactus field. Maybe I'm gonna get lucky and uh, no. Maybe it's gonna be in the no. Heh. Oh, it's all clover. It's always in clover, I feel. Come on, man. Da 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 boom. Now you've been destroyed and you're not coming back from that one. Well, that was pretty awesome. We destroyed a bunch of stuff. I showed you guys and told you guys and did stuff for you. But thank you guys for watching. Thank you all for being here. Remember to comment, like, and share this video around. Until we meet again. Until next time. Thank you all for watching. And remember, remember, this. So you can do stuff to help out. Comment, like, and share. Go watch more videos. Like and share those as well. And as always, if you have not done this yet, subscribe now and hit notifications. Till next time, guys. Till we meet again. Gremlins don't die. They multiply. Bye.